What is going on internet? My name is Brandon, welcome back to my channel. Today, I wanna go over six things that the new Assassin's Creed should have included in the game. So Ubisoft today released the new trailer for the new Assassin's Creed game. This franchise has been very near and dear to my heart. I still remember playing the first Assassin's Creed game on the Xbox 360 back in the day. Fast forward over time and it's been fun to see all these games evolve and how they've changed and how they've kind of taken a new Witcher stance on the new games. With that being said though, the new games were lacking in some areas and in my opinion these are the six things that I believe should be included with this next title. Number one, give us some trolls. What I mean by that is I feel we should be able to encounter some Norse gods and monsters. Norse mythology is deep in lore and if I wanted to I could ramble for days about all the monsters and mythical creatures they have in the lore. However with that being said they shouldn't be encountered all the time. It should be sparingly because I also want the game grounded in reality as well. Number two, is map size. Don't get me wrong when I say this, Odyssey was a great game. There was a lot of stuff to do, a lot to explore. However, the map was almost too big, if that makes any sense. I find myself sometimes in that game getting rather bored with all the travel time in between quests. So with the new game, I feel Ubisoft can trim the map down a little bit so there's more bulk in a smaller area. Number three, let's get rid of the level gating Ubisoft. For those who haven't played the recent game Odyssey, sometimes you couldn't move on with the main quest because you weren't high enough level. I feel if you're completing story missions, there shouldn't be a level cap in the way in order to progress through that, especially if you're in the flow of things. Which brings me to my fourth point, we need to make side questing matter more. That's one thing I found with these RPGs that I play, whether it be Assassin's Creed, even going back to Skyrim. The side quests are there for entertainment, but they don't really yield much for the world around you. So maybe in this game, as an example, maybe if you do a side quest for someone, maybe they join you on a pillage run or something like that. It'd make the game more dynamic and also add a lot of replayability and more incentive to go do the side quest, especially if you can recruit members to your tribe or whatever you want to call it. The fifth thing is I want bigger emphasis on stealth. Assassin's Creed over the years has relied heavily on hiding in haystacks, hiding in bushes, and also hiding in crowds. In this game, I want clothing choice to matter with stealth. Like let's say maybe I can camouflage myself in some mud or I can steal clothing off a village I pillage or something like that and I can wear that and then I'm now disguised within that country's people so it's easier to sneak around and do assassinations. After all the game is called Assassin's Creed so we need to make stealth matter in this next game. Finally, number six, we need bigger emphasis on co-op. I get it, they're trying to make this a single player experience similar to The Witcher. I know I keep bringing it up, but that's what they're trying to do with this, or with the series the last, at least the last two games, is making it into a Witcher type experience. Let's put bigger emphasis on co-op. So if I'm in the middle of a mission, my buddy can log on, get in the boat with me, or get on the ground with me, we can run through a mission, and then he can back out after that. Drop in and out co-op essentially is what I'm after make the game more fun to be able to play with friends. I know they tried that in a previous title, however, 2020, we should be able to have a much better experience with that. And if you made it to the end of this video, I also have a seventh thing I want in this game. And I'm sure a lot of people can agree with this who follow Viking mythology. Can we just blood, e blood eagle somebody, please? Just once. Anyway, that's all I have for this video. Comment below what you thought is if there's anything I missed that you want to see in this next game, I'd be curious to see what you guys have to say. As always, it's never goodbye. It's only till next time.